Welcome folks to another episode of Crispy Card Corner, WWE Supercard, episode 8. Not going to go over much today, it's going to be a quick episode. Um, for those of you that, uh, that want to donate for Axel Rotten, I will put the link below. I'll go ahead and put that link below. Uh, for those of you that missed it yesterday, I'm going to go ahead and put that link below. Uh, help out Axel Rotten, he really needs it. And there's only a matter of days left for that. Now, we're going to go into our, our gameplay here. Uh, we got two days and seven hours for Fusion Chamber. Uh, we don't have much going on uh, today, nothing much to talk about. I did make a mistake though, I apologize. Um, we were supposed to have, uh, I, th I thought we were going to have PCC, but I read it, I misread wrong, and I apologize, we're having a ring domination, which I'll show you that right now. I'm going to go ahead and, uh, I'll show you the tutorial of how we play ring domination for those of you that are unfamiliar with the game. Ring domination challenges you to fight for total ring control. Opponents and rewards are based on your ring dem domination deck tier. Use bouts to play ring domination games and earn pieces. Once used, bouts refill over time, almost like the Road to Glory. Which I'm going to show you the tutorial of that once we get once we do that again. In ring domination games, a superstar's alignment is used to initiate challenges. So let's say you have an up arrow, you. You challenge the up arrow, you challenge right, you challenge down, you challenge left. Win a challenge and the spot is yours. Lose the spot. Lose and the spot goes to your opponent. The player with the most spot of most squares wins. It's almost like a tic-tac-toe game. All games must be completed before time runs out. Ring domination. Do you have what it takes? Well, we'll try. We're going to do our best with this. It's not an easy thing. And these shards represent uh, the picks. Like they do on the board for exhibition, they represent your picks. And uh, each one you get will reveal a different piece of the card. A, a puzzle of a card. So, it's pretty interesting. You have to really think for this one. And you got to use some strategy. So, it's not that bad. So, just showing you an idea of what ring domin what to expect in ring domination, and that's going to start in another 21 hours. It's going to start tomorrow, and I'll show you some gameplay of that tomorrow. Okay, let's go. That's not going to be a long episode today, so we're going to go ahead and we're going to we're going to start King of the Ring later on in the week. Right now, we're going to go ahead and play some exhibition matches. Nothing too bad. Well, it's early in the morning, so I want to get this video out the way and over with. I gotta go to work. Uh, I gotta go to work today, so I'll probably have this video up later on today, possibly. So we'll go ahead and pick Paige for our diva. It looks like uh, I got beat there by Naomi. She's she's a pretty good card. She's not she's not the best card, but she's a pretty good card. Go again. Power. Got Bray Wyatt for that. Gonna hit speed. Got the ultimate warrior. We win that match. Ultimate warrior is my champion. I'm gonna go ahead and pick two cards. All right, let's get on to the next. Let's get on to the next game here. We're only going to play five uh, five matches today. Nothing too bad. So how are you guys doing today? You guys doing okay? Um, like I said, I'm going to leave the link on the bottom for the Axel Rotten uh, donation. So please, if you can, try to donate for him. He really needs it. I'm going to leave the link at the bottom of the... I'm gonna, ah, like I said, I'm going to leave the link at the bottom of the description for you guys to donate. And go ahead and pick our diva.
I don't know if you guys saw, um, Hulk Hogan, uh, tweeted something, and, um, fans liked it, uh, I guess the fans that are still supporting Hulk Hogan, um, he put a tweet out there saying that, uh, he'll overcome everything, and then he put a tweet for the people that, that were against him, so it was kind of weird, but, I mean, I, I could see his point, too, in a way. So, that, that's that. So, I don't even, I don't even know who's going to be the, uh, the tough enough. I don't, I don't think I even saw tough enough. I gotta, I gotta watch tough enough again, but, uh, who's the new, who's the new, uh, who's the new instructor, coach that is in tough enough now that replace Hulk Hogan? Just, uh, feel free to let me know in the comments below. I, I like to, I like to know who it was. We got tag team here. We're not going to spend too much time today. So we're going to go ahead and eliminate them. Pick our two cards again. Alright, this is match three. Uh, hopefully, folks, I'll be able to put up new content. Hopefully, put up WWE Immortals and Clash of Clans. I really don't play that much of those, but I'll try my best to try to put some new content up. I'll go ahead and pick Bray Wyatt. I got to watch Raw the other day. I thought Raw was very impressive. Um, the whole Kevin Owens and, and Randy Orton, I thought that was an awesome match. The whole feud with Cesaro and Kevin Owens, that's pretty cool. I was very excited about Raw. The Divas match was amazing. And especially Bray Wyatt. I love his promos. He has the best promos in WWE. And uh, Luke Harper, they finally let Luke Harper speak, which was awesome. I was really impressed with that. Luke Harper starting to come on his own with his promos. I was very impressed by that. Very impressed by his uh, promo. He did an awesome job. Um, they gotta, they gotta keep building him up. Hopefully, uh, if Eric Rowan comes back, maybe he'll join the Wyatt, Wyatt family again. That sounds, that'll be really awesome if uh, once Eric Rowan comes back from his injury, he could join the Wyatt family and they could, they could uh, reunite all over again. That, that'd be pretty cool. Awesome match between Seth Rollins and John Cena during Raw. I thought that was a great match. They both put on a clinic. And John Cena got a busted up nose, but uh, he still won the match. So he, that, that was an awesome match. I was very impressed. He ended up beating Seth Rollins, beat the champion, uh, made him tap out with the STF. So that's pretty cool. I was impressed with Raw. Very impressed. Uh, the creative is getting better with their storylines once again, and I'm, I'm happy about that. Now we go ahead in our fourth match here. We pick our cards. Go ahead and pick Pele. And we go one on one against Pele. Got power. We're gonna pick Bray Wyatt. That's my boy. Solo match gonna pick my pick the rock. And of course we'll pick our tag team. That's not gonna win because it looks like oh maybe we will win. And we won the match. I'm gonna pick two cards here. I'll pick one more match for you folks. And that will end the video.
Bray Wyatt, baby. He's the man. He is the man. They're using him more, and I'm very happy that they're using him a lot more. So, it's it's good. It's very good. WWE is getting up there now. What do you guys think? You guys uh, guys going to watch that Lucha on the ground this week? Uh, the Ultima Lucha that's coming up. That looks really impressive. That's an impressive card. Can't wait to see that. So, uh, hopefully I can... I'll try to give you the results of that if I can. But uh, it's going to be very impressive. I don't watch that until Thursday, so I don't get to... And NXT is getting up there, too, like their storylines. So, uh, can't wait to see that. We got our power guy. Go ahead and pick Ultimate Warrior for that. Fit we'll wrap up this game. We're going to pick our two picks. All right, we're gonna go ahead and uh, and end it here. Okay, and, uh, for those of you that uh, have been watching, thank you for watching. Please feel free to click or subscribe, and I hope to see you in the next one. And once again, I will put the Axel Rotten um, donation link on the bottom of the description. So uh, just look for that and please donate. Help him out. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching. Um, and for those that are new, my name is Chris, and I'll be bringing you WWE Supercar content each and every day. So thank you for watching. Please click a subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.